I've come to the realization what? that I. You? This might sound a bit egotistic. From you? <laughs> From you? What? I am the best. Yeah. In the world, I'm the best air passenger. Just like I've never caused any flight attendant any issue. But I took three flights recently. Each of them went across the Atlantic Ocean. Brag about it. And, <laughs> and I got hit every single time by a new. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't mean... grab the mic arm and Why? swing it into Gavin's face. All right, I won't tell the story. Imagine it was story. his cover. You were <laughs> the pause, the timing of the pause with you looking at it. It was, it was great. You were, uh, you were a jet setter flying uh, across the uh, the Atlantic Ocean. Yeah. So the first flight, I get on the plane. I'm in the window. So no, I'm in the aisle, and there's a woman in the window. She makes me get up after we've sat down to like fiddle with our bags. I'm like, all right, give it a know, fiddle. Could have done that earlier, but whatever. Uh -huh. Then this is still before we've everyone's boarded. She gets up again and moves to a different seat as people are still boarding. Oh, so I was like, is that is this not your seat then? I, was, I didn't say it. I was just like weird. Also, people are still boarding. Yeah. So how does she know that seat? Then empty? the people whose seat it is come along and they're like, you're in my seat, and she's like. Oh, well, it didn't look very busy, and uh, so I just took this seat. And they were like, well, that's our seat. And, it, and the flight was full, by the way. Every single seat on the flight was taken. Which is very common these days. Yeah. Most flights are full. So she made me get up again. So I've got up four times for this woman. Like, once for her getting in the seat, then getting out, then getting out, then getting in again. Do Annoying. you prefer being on the aisle or in the middle or the window? Middle. It depends. Window for an overnight flight. Aisle for a not. Right, because you put your I, head on the wall and sleep? Yeah. That's Second right. flight, right? Second flight. It was a flight to Germany. I get in. I'm in the aisle on the side. International flight. There's like a side bit. You were not sitting with the rest of the achievement hunters. Why? Because you book separately? No, I just don't like flying with people. Good call. Please tell me it was the same woman next to you. No. <laughs> oh, <laughs> damn it. I get on. The German version. The, uh, the window seat's empty, so I know I'm going to have to get up at some point. The biggest, fattest German dude makes me get up. He sits there, pulls the armrest up. Oh, no. Well, then, because he needs when to I, fit. Yeah, when I sit down, he's spilling like almost halfway into my seat and puts his leg in my footwell. And I'm no like way. This, and I'm like, I can't sit on a nine hour flight next to this. Yeah. Then I was going to like, I was going to text Jeff something to like look out for him. He <laughs> saw me using my phone. He was like, let me call my wife on that. What? And I was what? like, are you crazy? Let me call my yeah, wife he's like, on that. I need to call my wife. You let me call my wife? I like he says, I'm that. Like, he's yeah. never seen a he's cell like, phone. Oh, phone? I'm familiar with those. I'm, I need to call my wife. And I was like, uh, I mean, it's not, it's, it's an English Unless phone. you're calling her to pick yeah. you up from this flight and right like, now. <laughs> he was like, don't worry, it's not long distance. I was like, what does that mean? Like, she know who, where you're... you don't know where my phone's registered to? Yeah. I'm English on a, an American flight to Germany? You don't know where I'm from. Also, well, maybe like... she was in his stomach. So <laughs> it's not that far away. He ate her just before the flight. He needs to call an ambulance. That was the, that was. Did the you let part. him use that's, your phone? It's the worst. No, no, I didn't. And I lied to him and I said it, it wouldn't work. And then I moved seats because the flight wasn't that full. Yeah. Oh, I moved to a middle lying. seat in, in five. Like that was more preferable than being on the aisle wow. on an international flight. I get antsy and claustrophobic. You want to see a picture of the guy who was... Who you was took a picture of him? Oh, I, I took this. a picture I after I this. moved. Oh, what? <laughs> <laughs> and then actually in the middle of the flight, he got up and started walking around. And like put his hand all over Jack's screen. We, we actually Jack have a photo here. I found it <laughs> uh, on the internet <laughs> of uh, Gavin on his fly. <laughs> <laughs> Someone tweeted this to us. I'll give him credit in just a second. There's a comedian who had a whole bit about the etiquette of here, he the three oh, seats oh, on a oh, plane. That was uh, hold that ghost on Twitter. Uh, tweeted us that photo or that image. Look at I guess. Let me see that. That dude is real. That dude is chillaxing. He was just spewing across both. How many wow. pounds do you think he was? I don't know. Or uh, kilograms. That's rough. Oh, it's a big dude. He's like wow. laid out, yeah, like his head up against the window and just like he's already he's, in Gavin's seat. You can clearly yeah. see he's in Gavin's seat. Well, he's lying down, so yeah. Okay, he's third flight. Himself. This guy put both hands behind his head and interlinked his fingers over my screen. Wow. I literally couldn't see a single piece of the screen. What did I was you like, do? I just waited. I didn't know what to do. I you didn't. didn't I didn't want to like be like poke him in the hand and be like. Get your hand off my screen, because he's watching his screen. He knows that there's a there's a screen there. He can also feel yeah. it, right? With so his I was hands? like, I let it go for like a minute. I paused it. I was just like, I just I want to shoot myself in the face. About an hour later, he did it again and started like tapping on it like bongos. And he was like rewinding, changing the movie, like flicked it to the radio. I was like, ah, 
I'm gonna I'm gonna die. Wow. Why do I keep getting sat next to pricks? You're on a plane. Don't it's be a prick. because you're so far the other way that you notice whenever someone's yeah. a prick. The etiquette what? for that, though, is that when that happens, is you just reach out, grab the seat top in front of you, and just shake it. <laughs> I thought you were going to say reach out and just grab their hands.